you cool cats and welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts. This is Mina and we are going to Kakariku's butt. Um, I have rested my hands, they feel really good right now, so with any luck, um, it'll just be like, you know, a quick little thing that we just kick his butt and we're over with it. Um, I might be rusty. I have a feeling I might die pretty quickly. Um, at least once until I remember how to do this entire fight because I've rested and that means that I'm not prepared for this. Um, I do remember that I want to conserve my MP- oh shoot, did I- did I set arrow? Please tell me I set arrow. No, I didn't! Ah! Alright, well. What's nice about Riku is that he is pretty predictable. Well, what now? And like, whatever you approach. Oh, he's doing that thing where he's waiting for to hit me. Like, if you if you leave yourself open for something, he's always gonna go for it. Well, what now? I wonder if I could hit him with magic during this phase. And I really regret not setting arrow. <laughs> oh no. See, I don't want stop. Uh, can I can I just reset this? I really don't want to do this. See, like he always goes for that. If I if I swing and I miss, he always jumps. And he always does that charge, and he always does that as a reaction to that. <laughs> It's, it's nice, because he's predictable. In this phase of the fight, I actually really like fighting him. It's And and the thing about like the last time I played was I was so beat down by Maleficent, I wasn't talking at all. And this is kind of why I like failing, at least, in the first time I fight him, because the first time I'm fighting, I'm so busy trying to memorize what's going on that I don't think about talking to you guys, which is pretty unentertaining, I would say. Ah! And when I talk, I tend to make mistakes more. Not that I don't make mistakes when I don't talk, it's just that when I'm talking, I'm trying to juggle thoughts and what I'm doing at the same time. Exposed. Exposed! You just basically have to wait for the time when he does that. Uh huh. Oh, here we go. So this is where he starts doing that slash thing. And I don't remember how many of those he does, to be honest. I do want to give up, but mostly because I don't have arrow set, not because I don't want to fight you. Okay, so witness true powers when he starts doing this. Two. So he can do anywhere between two and who knows how many. No! I hate that. One. Only one. That's a that's a move I, I don't like because it's got way too much RNG. <laughs> oh god, here we go. So I don't know where the safe spot is for that attack. Also, I was gonna die, but that's fine. I really actually wanted to die. Uh, continue isn't gonna start me immediately in the battle, is it? I don't remember. Okay, that's this is fine. This is fine. 
I actually really wanted to die. <laughs> uh, um, because, so... Customize, right. Okay, Cura. So the square I can make as arrow because I, I don't see myself I don't see myself casting a single other spell besides Kira and that. And then I can work my items. <laughs> I'm I'm going to assume that the thing that I need the most is uh is not gonna be health. Well, you know what? It might be health. But I think and I didn't need Mega Ele What am I doing? Just put ethers. I guess I'll throw in an elixir. I really think that, like... <laughs> I, I mostly need MP. Okay, deep breath. And part of the reason why I might die more is because I'm trying to be a, a lot more aggressive. Um, cause I don't think, I don't think my, my pass, my passive, my passiveness did make me get to like the, the, you know, end of the fight faster, but, um, my passiveness is kind of a little too passive and it's not really like, not really like making me better at the game. It's just a little too much passive. So I just need to uh, find a balance here between not making stupid plays and also being a little more aggressive and conserving the MP for the later phases of the fight. I almost ran into that. I did it. That's something I hate doing. No, oh, thank you. and I'm not gonna know what to do. I'm not gonna know what to do. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to get back there and I'm going to be stuck again. I found at least what I would consider a safe spot. By the way, that safe spot was basically after I beat, or not beat, blah, 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 after I got done with the last stream, I, uh, or recording, I, uh, I watched back to that spot and I noticed that like right there was when I uh 
I've noticed that like that spot was actually safe and that made me want to uh, experiment with the next time I got there if that spot was safe. And it seems safe. And the mo like, there's probably plenty of safe spots, but the reason why I like that particular safe spot is because there's like a, a visual there. It's not just like me guessing where the safe spot is. And it could just be, you go anywhere on the wall and you're safe, but like, oh, my nose itches. You know what would be really upsetting is if I find out that I have to learn how to guard to beat him. That would, that would totally break, <laughs> that would break me. <laughs> I'd be like, uh, so uh, when can I play Kingdom Hearts 2 again? <laughs> Next year? I mean, if I can't figure out a strategy for that phase, I'm going to just assume that I need, like, to grind or something and be able to basically just shrug off him. Which is going to be very upsetting. <laughs> Oh shoot. I was not prepared for this. <laughs> I deserve that death. I uh, I went into that combo without healing because I wanted to be way more aggressive. Which I was. Because <sighs> I just want to fight that part of the fight that I suck at. <laughs> Can you just let me have a couple of hits? Just a couple. Asking for a friend. Ah, I saw myself getting hit by that, but there was nothing I could do. I, I hate how much I have to fight with the camera for this. Darkness. 
people's hearts. I wonder. Sora? Were you gonna stab yourself like... Sora! Hold on! trouble doing that why didn't we just let Riku beat me <laughs> wait I'm confused were all the princesses inside Sora I'm confused Is this the ending of the game? at last, princess. The keyhole is now complete. You have served your purpose, but now it's over. Do you think we can stop him all by ourselves? I don't know. Uh, impossible. No. Uh. You won't use me for this. Riku! You've got to run! The Heartless are coming!
Whoa! Oh, I thought this was still a cutscene. What the? Is this just like the adventures of the Heartless chasing after Kyrie and. They're all sleeping still. So. Chasing after Donald, Goofy, and uh, Kyrie? Am I supposed to just drop down there? Where am I going? Okay, let me just guess that we're going all the way back to the beginning, because I don't want to have to search every single area. Wait. Whee! I'm just going to guess that we went all the way back to the beginning into, like, the throne room area. Not the throne room, like the entrance way, whatever. Or maybe the library. Because, like, I would imagine cutscenes would happen in, like, fantastic looking areas. Oh, there we go. Kyrie, hurry! I can't leave them behind. We can't stay here! The Heartless is after us. I'll take care of him! protect you. I'm a heartless? Leaving without Bell. Now go! The Heartless are coming. All right. Let's get out of here. Where, Where are we going from here? Riku's in trouble, I think. Is this the end of the game? I don't understand. Tell me what happened. So the darkness is flowing out of that keyhole. No wonder there are more and more heartless everywhere. The only way to stop them is... Seal the keyhole, right? Maybe. But no one knows what will happen once it's sealed. Well, we can't just stay here. We have to do something. I've got a friend back there. That's right. You have one more friend to worry about. Riku's Keyblade must have been born of the captive princess's hearts. Just like that keyhole you saw. Of course, without Kairi's heart, it remained incomplete. Once that Keyblade was destroyed, the princess's hearts should have been freed. Don't worry, Sora. If anyone can save your friend, you can. It's heartwarming. Am I going back there? Uh, 
Okay, let's read this because it's new. Um, Sora, the one who fights the Heartless. Upon reclaiming the Keyblade from his rival Riku, Sora sacrificed his heart to free Kairi and became a Heartless. Kairi's deep feelings for Sora restored him. Now he must confront Ansem, the Seeker of Darkness. When Kairi lost her heart, Riku allied himself with Maleficent to save her. Riku was actually the rightful master of the Keyblade, but once he chose darkness over light, the weapon chose Sora instead. Ansem exploited Riku's weakness of heart and possessed him. Oh, really? Kairi, Sora, and Riku always hung out together. When their island vanished, Kairi lost her heart. It turned out that it was hidden within Sora's. <coughs> As one of the princesses with the power to unlock the secret keyhole, Kairi restored Sora's heart when he was turned into a heartless. Maleficent, a sorceress of awesome power, she tried to use the heartless for her own evil ends, but when the heartless but the heartless were actually using her, she turned into a huge dragon when cornered by Sora and his friends. She first appeared to curse Aurora in Sleeping Beauty 1959. Dragon. Maleficent became a huge dragon when the Keyblade released the darkness in her heart. The dragon wielded both Maleficent's power and terrible for forces of darkness. Maleficent's powerful alter ego first appeared in Sleeping Beauty 1959. Ansem. As a researcher of the world and ruler of his world, he studied the Heartless and delved into many secrets of the worlds. While studying the heart and the darkness within it, he was possessed by darkness and ultimately destroyed his own world. He sacrificed his body to attain great power and later possessed Rikus to regain a physical presence. Failure to stop him means the end of all worlds. Yikes. Rare Truffle. Oh, I think I read that one in a previous one. Not gonna read it again. So... Oh, right. Um... Let's talk to them. Not sure why, but the Heartless are getting stronger. New types of Heartless are popping all over the place. If anything happens to us, I know we can count on you, Sora. Sora, are you feeling okay now? If you're not, then say so. I thought the keyhole would strengthen the darkness. I mean, the darkness is strong, but still, it's almost as if it is holding the darkness back. It seems the other princesses have been free as well. Jasmine apparently hasn't returned to Agrabah. I suspect the others are still in the castle too. Okie dokie. So we gotta go back. And I guess that there will be more Heartless running around. Where am I? Oh. But you know what? No Heartless is like spawning, which means that the horrifying pink one's probably out and about. It's probably chasing me. Get me out. I don't want to fight it. Sid, I know you need to go back to Hollow Bastion. I don't think I can let you do that, kid. The Heartless there are multiplying by the minute. They'll eat your ship up. Then what can we do? Zip will go around him instead of through. Install a new navigation gummy and take a new route. A new gummy? From where? Secret waterway. When I came here nine years ago, I stored it in there in case I ever needed it. Never thought a kid would be the one to use it. find all of the postcards my memory is bad I wonder if the workshop if I can make anything new with this workshop um, is it you that I need to talk to nope I can't make any of this new stuff or old stuff rather Oh, you guys are new. You were not here before. Hey, Kyrie's in here. Hi, Kyrie. What a mysterious mural. It's almost hypnotizing. I guess that's a hint for me to go over here. 
Navi gummy. Let's go back and join the others. We should rest up. Okay. A light at the end of the tunnel. Oh, your grandma's story, right? That's right. We were together. You know what's funny? I looked everywhere for you, but you were with me all along. Finally, we're together, Kyrie. Now, it's time to get Riku back. It's kind of cute. You think it'll ever be the same again between us? Riku's lost his... When I turned into a Heartless, you saved me, remember? I was lost in the darkness. I couldn't find my way. As I stumbled through the dark, I started forgetting things. My friends, who I was, the darkness almost swallowed me. But then, I heard a voice. Your voice. You brought me back. I didn't want to just forget about you, Sora. I couldn't. That's it! Our hearts are connected. And the light from our hearts broke through the darkness. I saw that light. I think that's what saved me. No matter how deep the darkness, a light shines within. I guess it's more than just a fairy tale. Well, let's go! You can't go. Why not? Because it's way too dangerous. Come on, Sora. We made it this far by sticking together. You can't go alone. Kairi, even if we're apart, we're not alone anymore, right? I can't help? You'd kind of be in my way. <laughs> okay. You win. Take this. It's my lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Don't worry. I will. Promise? Promise. Don't ever forget. Wherever you go, I'm always with you. Oathkeeper. Sora, Kairi, I'm sorry. Is this the afterworld? I'm not ready, not yet. Not until I see Sora and Kairi one last time. Riku, can you hear me? I'll be there soon. Who is that? I have the other Keyblade. The one that belongs to this world. I've been trying to get through to you, but the darkness in your heart kept me away. Who are you? What ha what's happened to me? Your heart won the battle against the darkness, but it was too late for your body. That's why you're here. In this place of darkness where hearts are gathered. I have no idea what voice I'm supposed to give here. So what do I do? The door of darkness will open soon, but it's a door we can't enter. It has to be closed from both sides. To do this, you need two keys and two hearts. Maybe you're here for the same reason I am. Maybe it was fate. Fate, huh? You seem to know everything. Then tell me. Are Sora and Kairi okay? Don't you feel the echoes of their hearts? You already know the answer. Look inside your own heart. Okay.
Whoever it is, it's it's not an unfriendly person. It's my lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Okay. Let's go see the fairy godmother, because I think she can turn some of the stuff that I have into summons. Not that I've been using them. <laughs> uh... Oh, another summon gem. Let's help this little one. Here we go. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Mushu. Thank you, Sora. Here's something for you. Lord Fortune. Take good care of them. Did I have another one? I guess not. Oh, I have a torn page. I guess we could do that. Like, that'll be a good way to end this episode, is just doing, um... Where is it? Oh, there it is. Doing this, because I have a feeling we have, like, a final boss fight confrontation to do. And that might take a whole episode. Let's see. I don't remember where I've been. Have I been here? Alright. Here's what we'll do. We'll go here, because I don't remember. Oh! Cutscene! Aces. We found one. So it's Tigger, and I think that's... Rue. Okay. That's... This here's my bouncing spot! We can bounce here all day! Nothing beats bouncing! You wanna bounce too, Sora? It's lots of fun. Okay. To bounce with the finest, you need some pointers from the finest. But Owl, you don't bounce around like we do. I'm afraid you're right. I can't master everything, I suppose. Bounce this way, please. Okay, I'm confused. What do I need to do? nothing in here so I don't I don't know oh hey I wonder what this is just a board and what do you want this tree doesn't have any honey I see Whatever, so maybe I'm just supposed to explore around. Or maybe talk to Owl? Your nuts grows on these trees. I'll trade you things for them. Nuts? Alright, well. I guess find the nuts. Do these trees need to be hit? just uncovered. Hey, there's a chest up there. Okay, I don't know how to get that. Um... There's something in there. How do I... How do I get it out? Oh. Just smash it. I don't know how to get in there. Maybe this hopping mini this hopping mini game thing is like to like climb up here. Oh my 
my gosh. Oh, I see a nut, I think. Is it that thing? Okay. 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 I can at least float over to this chest. All that for a mithril shard. So do I have to knock him out of the trees? Is that like what it is? understand what I have to do. Get down, damn you. Right? Because these are that this is the nut. Tell me I'm not going nuts. Any tips? Simon Says game. Oops. Just, I, I get it. I know what to do. <laughs> It'd be so much easier if the camera wasn't like jumping around though. Awesome, last one. Jump, jump. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so hard to land. <laughs> I got it. But like, I don't need the tutorial. <laughs> The 
big one. Whack the nuts back at the pot to shatter it. Oh my gosh. must have something, I guess. Ha! Oh, this was how you were supposed to get up here. Also, there's something in this tree. if you can actually obtain these 100 acre woods how does one even do that oh my god How does that help me in the slightest? Oh, there's a rare nut over here. Oh my gosh, just give me the rare nut. I'm, I'm gonna get mad. I'm going to get mad. I'm going to get mad. Do you see this? Deep freeze. My my anger levels are through the roof. I I I I am so angry. I'm so beside myself with anger right now. I can I can barely think. I can barely think. <gasps> All right, all right, all right, all right. 
how do I get the rare nut in 100 acre wood? It just says that they're a bit glitchy. They're a bit glitchy, you say? Glitchy. I'm gonna say this about all video games. When they have platforming, and they were not built for platforming, they become some of the most frustrating games known to man. going to do this again. I hate, I hate, I hate. I'm so emotionally hurt by this. Why? Why? But why? But why? But, but why? <gasps> but why? Why is that why it worked? Why? You know? <gasps> I see it! <gasps> you don't understand? I see it! 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 Screw it! Screw it. Whatever the last reward is, it can't be that good. Oh my god, I don't care. I don't... I don't care. Who does this to a person? Why? Why would you do this? Get me out of here. God, I never want... I never want to see Winnie the Pooh ever again! Thank you all for watching this episode of Kingdom Hearts. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. One filled with, with no Winnie the Pooh. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.